don't forget to watch 7 News straight after Green Fingers. But right now, it's all about the fish, and the Grey Fours are here to help us put silver perch into our new aquaponics ponds. And Kalinda's here from Woodvale Fish and Lily Farm. Hi everyone to tell us about how it's going to happen. So today we've got silver perch that are going to the tank for the first time. And what we've been doing is floating them in these bags to acclimatise them for about five minutes so the water temperature doesn't shock them too much. And now we're going to open up the bag, who wants to eat? Oh. And we're going to gently release the fish so they can swim into their new home. Any time you put new fish into a tank, it's always the most stressful time for your fish. So you've got to be as gentle as you can with them. Because it's a new system and the plants haven't grown yet, we're actually going to be adding some zeolite into the main pond and that's going to help take up any ammonia and excess fish waste that's in the system. And the zeolite in the pond is also going to help keep algae down and make the water certainly a lot more healthier for the fish because that's the most important thing is a, a nice clean environment for them. There you go, fishies! So growing your own fish at home really is this easy? It really is, as long as you've got you know, a good setup, good filtration which we will have when our plants have established, a bit of zeolite and a minimal amount of feeding regularly, you get good growth. So in the next tank we're going to put in marin and the first thing we're going to do is put in a marin hide so they've got more fun places to hang out. You know what, I think they're going to love it in here. Yeah. Remember they can buy. <laughs> 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 Good work. Yeah, well done. Oh, nice. Hey, you got some fight.